Old case here. Guess what that is? <clears throat> this is October 16. Get a little window washing fluid on it and get it off. But, yep. It was a real heavy dew that frosted. It's eight o'clock. I don't know if you can see that or not. I'm running behind. That's all right. It's Monday morning. I did get the rest of my calves caught and weaned on Saturday. You can't hardly see down in there. So I got them all pinned up now. Anyway, they, they didn't ball much last night, but when you're out around them, they ball a bunch. So anyway, I'm headed off to go to the woods, supposed to meet Kevin there, and I've got to take the <clears throat> Bob Cole logging truck. It's a little ways away from home, like five, six miles, so here's Bobby Cole today. And uh, maybe I'll get you some footage of that later. I also got firewood to haul, and I got to Another deal I'm going to look at and see what I think of that. So keep watching. Well, it's fall case here. It's been uh, a week. Friday or Monday, I think, was the last time I videoed. So back clip was Monday. This is Friday morning, about 8:30. We're uh, on a different logging job, but we're still cutting dead trees. <clears throat> and this guy's got some big ones. Let's see if I can manage to film long enough to get this one laid down on the ground, but it is a good one. There's uh, four or five of them big old red oaks out here. And the drought killed them. I never if I have pretty good frog down. Kevin's a cutting for me. I did get my calves all shuffled around last night in three pins, and I turned some of them out this morning. I gotta go look at a couple of herd bull prospects this evening, or this afternoon, and I got another load of firewood. And since Monday, we delivered, cut and delivered uh, seven loads of firewood. There she goes. And big old dead ones that break a limb out of the top of it and they'll come back at you. You really have to be careful. Well, I better get to work here. We'll see if I get a picture of the pile when we get done. Well, it's a little after 10.40, probably 10.45. He cut one, two, three, seven, eight, nine trees. He got these two piles of logs today. There's at least two, probably two and a half loads on my truck right there. So we don't have the truck today. Scott was using it. So we'll have to uh, get started hauling on Monday while he's cutting. He can't cut as much when I'm not there helping him, but those are all, probably all black oaks. All dead trees. I don't know if you can see the woods behind there. There's a bunch more. Anyway, I'll bring back for more later.